I think he had certain toughness and resilience, and that came through uh, when he went to school and he started being a, you know, playing sport, cricket and football. And it was at football that he really shone. I think that was one of the things where he really, really came to the fore. There's no doubt that Northampton Town, his, his, his teammates actually adored him. They, they adored his style of play, strong, he got a good, uh, good low, a good range of passing. They, are, they say he could shoulder charge with the best of them, really good shoulder charge. And they, they held him with some degree of affection. And I think, I think a couple of fans of the time obviously loved him too. It, this is for me a big eye opener. What he has done uh, uh, on the pitch, but also off the pitch. You know, uh, and, and, and must have been 10 times, 10 times worse to have um, been in that life. You know? But then also taking, taking his decision, wanting to protect his country as well, you know. Uh, yeah, it's, it, it is, it is, uh, it is a story where we can take a lot from and should take a lot from. White, black, whatever you are, we should, we should just look at him as a man and take a lot from him. So here's a man who's resilient, who's a leader, who cares for the men under him, who has shown that he can break barriers. And I think for that, Cobbler's fans and all of us should remember Walter Tull.